what is up, everybody? It's good to see you. Fallout Aesthetics, good to see you. Fraggle. Honest Hearts, best DLC. <laughs> nice. Yeah, good to see you. We are here. I installed a few, like, if you would have saw, if you saw the Vortex thing up, I installed a few stabilization mods. You can find any of the mods that I installed in Gopher's stabilization uh, collection on Nexus mods. Um, it's only those mods. Um, we're, we are doing dead money. So we're just gonna... Caesar's dead. Betty didn't see this coming when he was having his coffee. Hey, Happy New Year to you as well, Primo. It's not Ashton, that much. Legion. We're just uh, playing some dead money. Might not even slow them down. Yeah, it does. But we got these bastards pretty good today. Whatever happens from here on out, we killed that prick in the middle of his fortress. Ought to give the rest of them some to think about. We'll probably lose Rex forever again. Uh, no, this is just normal difficulty. I'm not doing anything hardcore. Hey, Doc Huckleberry, good to see ya. Um, what is our inventory right now? Okay, I'm gonna make a stop. Shit. Um... Getting jumped by free side thugs right there. So, what I'm doing right now is pretty much an inventory drop. Uh, we've already killed Mr. House, I'm pretty sure. Which means I can't turn in any more of the base game snow globes to be added to the collection, unfortunately. I'll use my noodle on that one next time. Wrong place. Oh good, I hear the dog. Alright, perfect. So we're just gonna dump... most of the things in here. Um, so we're not gonna have them. In fucking dead money. Christ. Whoops. But yeah, I'm just dumping. Anything that I consider clutter away. That way when we're like done with dead money and everything like that, we're gonna be pretty empty. Won't matter anyway. I'm gonna try to leave with all uh all the fucking gold bars, but we'll see how that pans out. Cause I have a lot of I have like the unofficial patch installed, and I swear to God that unofficial patch makes my Fucking normal strat. Oh shit. I took all. Oh no. Makes my normal strat of uh. sneaking out with them nearly impossible. Sorry to have to go through this all over again. Shit. Okay. Um. Time. Let's save two of them. Alright, dog bean out of here. Holy Christ. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Definitely fine. Um, see ya, see ya. See ya. Let's not fuck this up this time. Okay. 
Yeah, sorry about the wait in any actual gameplay here. We'll keep the scripture with us in honor of Joshua Graham. All right. Okay. Let's go start it up, boys. Dead money. One Warhammer mini for 40,000 caps? That sounds about right. I've never really played uh, any of the Warhammer stuff, but uh, I know that the collecting those like figures and stuff can probably get pretty expensive. Hope I don't get jumped by a Legion hit squad. We really pissed them off with our last venture when we stormed the fort and killed Caesar. Have I recruited Veronica yet? I don't think so. Jedi. Yo! Fat super chat from Will, fat five dollars. Just saying hello and supporting. Well, thank you, Will. And uh, I'm honored to be your first super chat in the live stream. And you're my first super chat of the new year. So, welcome to the stream and thank you for the support. I appreciate you, man. Yeah, Veronica's great. Um, I'm gonna have to say that I'm the most attractive prostitute in the Thorn there, Max Power. <laughs> Message retracted. Well, I still saw it and read it on stream. I'm the most attractive prostitute in the Thorn. Yeah, out here in Camp Forlorn Hope. So how's the audio? Uh, by the way. Hello. I, I always like to check with you guys. Game audio good. Uh, fucking mic audio good. And Will, uh, you, the super chat you did just went through on Streamlabs over here, so your name should be on the screen uh, here shortly. Sorry for the delay. Good is always good. All right. I just like to check. No, it's been a bit of a rough couple of days, rough start to the new year. My uh, mother-in-law, my wife's mom, uh, had to have an emergency surgery the other day yesterday. And uh, so she's going to be in the hospital for a week or so. She's fine, um, all things considered, but like, it's going to be some regular surgeries here this year. And she had to get some stuff removed and never fun. But uh, my wife's at the hospital with her, hanging out with her. And, that's been a little bit stressful, but other than that, everything's been- Oh yeah, they have, like, a place for you to dump your shit. Alright. Level 20 couriers. What level are we? Oh, we're level 24, boy. Oh, Sergeant Dornan, man. I'm very sorry to hear that. Very fucking sorry to hear that. Uh, I'm a huge uh, dog parent myself. And so uh, my thoughts are with you on that. That's terrible. And uh, you saw the Xbox shout out. Yeah, dude. Excellent stuff. Yeah, my, my cousin James actually uh, got a cameo from him. Like, as a birthday Christmas present for me. Uh, and then, like, he ended up doing it for free and then talking about how he had, like, seen me online and shit. It was pretty neat. Always liked X-Pog, man. He's fucking top tier. You've heard of the Sierra Madre Casino. We all have. The legend. The curses. Foolishness about it lying in the middle of the city of the dead, buried beneath a blood-red cloud, a bright, shining monument luring treasure hunters to their doom. The world's most famous stars and entertainers were invited to its grand opening. An invitation was a sign of exclusiveness, 
The opening was supposed to symbolize a road to a brighter future. Uh, Fallout aesthetics, I'm not using a pop filter right now. I usually, if I'm recording a video, I 100% do. Um, I haven't been using them on a stream recently. I've been using uh, the Selgato Wave 3 uh, Starfield Edition. Fucking white with little blue ending of mic shit on it. It's still out there in the wastes, preserved, just waiting for someone to crack it open. But getting to it, that's not the hard part. It's letting go. Yeah, the hard part's letting go, guys. The fuck? I'm gonna try not to be do doing that on the stream. Good. From now on, when I talk, listen, and follow my instructions. Play stupid. Play clever. Make the mistake of saying. Yeah, this is just that Elgato Wave 3 for the mic quality. I wish I could record my videos with this microphone, but for some reason it pops in my fucking uh, recording software. I use Mixcraft to record my stuff, Mixcraft, Acoustica Mixcraft. Uh, it doesn't so much with Audacity, and I feel like it's taxing my system somehow, uh, or I don't have it set up right. I can't figure it out. What I'm going to probably end up doing, because I, I bought an XLR setup and a different mic, and that's what I've been using for my recording, but I really like the way this one sounds. Um, I'm going to try plugging in my other Wave 3 uh, into my laptop and recording uh, audio for my videos like that, and seeing if that, like fixes that problem because I n had never had that problem before and I love the way this fucking mic sounds. Sounds great. Anyway. It's like that big boy on your wrist. Except filled with explosives. A little radio of the old world. Just needed some tune. Do what I say. And the call will move. Refuse. Try and run. Disobey me. I'll kill you and find someone else. There's no escape from here until I let you go. The sooner you accept your situation, the better. That structure you see above the fountain, the Sierra Madre Casino, you need to break inside. Ah, uh, ice. Too many years in the making. But to get inside... Easterness. Uh, no, I... What's what's fucking cool about Underrail is I used to play uh, these games called F Online or F Online, F Online, and they are uh, servers that host like Fallout One and Two on multiplayer maps, where you know each server typically had between fifty and hundred people on it, and uh, you'd play and stuff. But the guy who made Underrail used to play the F Online games uh, with us. And I like <laughs> like to see that his game did so well is fucking amazing. Um, I haven't really played it myself, but uh, I know how good it is. You know what I mean? I just I have such a huge backlog that I there's so many things I absolutely need to play, and that's on my list big time. Undertale is on my list as well, even though some people seem on the fence about it, like either like it or hate it. But I heard it's a I'm an Earthbound fan, and I heard it's worth playing through if you are so. Around the world with three other callers like yours. Caller 8, 12, and 14. Find all three and get them The here. Dead Man's Hand? Dude, Jedi, I, uh, I don't know what that is off the top of my head. ...about killing each other and taking the treasure of the Sierra Madre for yourself. A warning. All your callers are living. Dude, yeah, I have like 560 games on fucking Steam, and my wife actually got mad at me because of the winter sale, like I spent way too much money on the winter sale, and uh, she was like, you're never gonna play any of these games, and I was like, fuck, like, so I was like trying to make a point and like going through and like playing them all, <laughs> so like... <laughs> I've downloaded the instructions and markers on your Pip Boy, in case you forget, and yes, I have access to that device on your wrist. The oh, the dead man's hand, the cards. Oh, shit. No, probably not, man. Do this. I'll let you go. I'll let all of you go. Yeah, because I got all the achievement, uh, all the achievements in the game, so when it comes to doing stuff like that, like, 
<laughs> like, uh, I did it once for Xbox and once for Steam, and uh, you know, it's I usually, honestly, when I'm streaming Dead Money, um, my biggest thing is uh, getting through the goddamn thing. Um, not that I don't like it or anything like that, but like just getting through it in a streamly manner is uh, a goal for me. I'm kind of an idiot dipshit kind of guy and uh getting through this as quickly and painlessly as possible is my uh true intention hey bum fungus welcome by the way after this conversation with elijah since we have uh 100 viewers i'm going to be gifting uh 10 memberships in the chat the bomb callers come with radios embedded in them you can eavesdrop easily it was part of their design to listen in to say thank you and welcome to the new year for everybody who's watching. Again, um, you can't pick who you choose, uh, like who the memberships go to. It seems to be random, so I hope you get one. Dude, uh, and Rissa, it's been a long fucking time. Good to see you. And uh, Kabis uh, Kab Kabuskus, it's good to see you too. One is a trusted ally. Obedient, caller unknown. Although the caller helps. Oh, okay, so the Mr. House emoji. I misunderstood what it meant. So I already have like 120 members worth of emojis or some shit like that. So until I get past that number, it won't unlock because I've already unlocked that number. I thought it was telling me like, oh, hey, if you hit this next milestone, you get another emoji unlock. But what it was saying is like, you know, that's what typically would happen had I not already unlocked it. So I have to... I have to fucking, uh, I think, I think it's at like 115 or 120, so we'll, we'll figure it out when it happens. And then Mr. House will be added, yeah. Um, and hey, uh, Happy New Year back to Greece there, Easterness. Good. If necessary, I will guide you through the villa's broadcast systems. If you get lost, return here and I'll direct you. I've downloaded instructions on an audio log to your pip boy in case you can't read. If you forget why you're here, let my voice remind you. Alright, so let's gift 10 memberships in the chat just to say thank you to you guys. Um, I put this up just in case it tries to show my fucking card info or something when I do this. <laughs> um, so yeah, we'll gift 10 of them. And uh, I can't do it like that. Okay, we should be good to go. Gifted 10 memberships. All right, boys, there you go. Thank you very much for the support and hanging out in chat. Oh, Sergeant Dornan got one. Lost Wolf got one. Welcome to the memberships. Max Monroe got one. AJ Jose got one. Clay Skelly, Troy Addict, Werewolf Knight, Marshall Hogan, Bobby Baloney, the raccoon that stole Marty's pizza. I don't know if that's all of them or not. It looks like that might be all of them. So hopefully you guys wanted them and hopefully somebody who wanted them got one. So yeah, just thank you guys for coming out. Little gift from me to you. All right. Oh, and we got a fat 20 Canadian dollars coming in from... Uh, Boba on my fence. <laughs> I uh, I will try to have a fun playthrough. Uh, I actually get pretty stressed out when it comes to dead money, so. Thank you very much for the super chat. Oh, we got a ghost right there, boys. Oh my god. Discover this location. Okay. Hey, Azriel, sorry that you didn't get one. Uh, Happy New Year back to you. Oh, the ghost is gone. Of course it is. Fuck yeah, man. Love the ambience of this fucking DLC. It's so good. Yeah, welcome to a tribe called Mantis. That's right, Doc. Um... Okay, he ain't dead. Mm. 
There we go. Okay. Take all and we'll just repair it. This is how where the real boys play. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, hell yeah, Nuke Man. Uh, I plan to do a lot more streams this year. Yeah, well, Patty, thank you for making the emojis for our, uh, the members. Uh, I appreciate it a lot. Oh, we should be picking some of these up, too. I'm going to be playing more games on the stream, too, than just Fallout games. Like... I typically will run through a Fallout, then we'll start another Fallout, you know, so that those kind of playthroughs are always... Uh, a Fallout playthrough is always going to be happening on the stream. You know, like, either the classic games or the Bethesda games or something, you know. But, um... Uh, I, I want to have other games going simultaneously as well, you know, have a playthrough of a different game going. Okay, watch out for the cloud, but I'm going to take out that Red Roach. I'm also going to quick save often. Watch for traps, boys. Oh, shit. Ooh, shit. Okay. All right. Piss. I don't have any lockpicks. Nah, overall blues is alright. Nice try. What do we got here? Find God in the simplest of beasts. I will. Good advice. Oh shit. Oh, the fucking collars. It's kind of going through these to make sure. Uh, yeah, I think there's one under us. Turn the door off. Ooh, boy. We're fucking good to go now, man. And a fucking cosmic knife. Hello. See... One thing that you need to do in, in Sierra Madre here, and it's adjacent areas, is really look around for shit. The more stuff you can get around here, the better. Yeah, Tildy Unlock, yeah, I, you know, I try not to do that on the, on the streams here. I typically will use the console, like, uh, if I'm stuck somewhere. Like, if I'm absolutely just... Fucked, like I'll, you know, I'll use to clip through an area or something. He's watching, waiting for you to try and let, let me go. Nine Sierra Madre chips right there. Twelve of them. Fuck it, just give them to me. Dog is such a good character. God and dog, it's like I love it. Here we're gonna do this. The one in the cage. Dog. I had to lock him up. He keeps disobeying me. Okay. 
Okay, it looks like my wife is on her way home, so if you hear my dogs freak out, I apologize. And Daniel Adelano, good to see you again, man. Five fat, uh, five fat. Fat five dollar super chat. Yo, yo. You were in a dark place last time you were here. Did you seek help because of my bad thoughts? Then? Wow, dude. Hell yeah, man. Well, I'm happy to hear that you're seeking help and that, uh, you don't let that kind of shit, uh, actually win, man. That's the, that's the actual, the actual winning comes from not letting that shit win. And understanding that you're not alone in feeling that way, like, fucking everybody feels that way at some point, you know what I mean? But also, Daniel, I'm really glad that you're here, man, and that you, and the, uh, you showed up to the stream. It's been a while since I've seen you in the chat. And it's fucking dope to see you, brother. Welcome back. We're playing some dead money. Hey, Will has become a part of a tribe called Mantis. Thank you, Will. That's me there on the table. The disc. My voice. Can't take any chances, though. Oh, there I have to play it. Oh, near dog stuff. Yeah. Stumbled down here. If so, can't let you let dog out. No, not yet. If you're who I think you are, you came to fetch dog. Use him to drag others here. Now I'll use you and that pip boy you're wearing. How does he know about the pip boy? That's my question. I mean, is he watching us right now? Oh, you can sleep in here. That's handy to know. I'll be good this time. I promise, Master. Just keep him away. I also have no idea where any fucking Bobby Pins are. Daniel with another fat fucking super chat. You don't know why New Vegas feels so rushed, Bethesda? I don't know why New Vegas feels so rushed. Bethesda. Are you questioning Bethesda? Because they got the 18 month. You know, a lot of the de a lot of the devs don't seem too upset about that. But I do agree that if uh, New Vegas had more time, it definitely because it doesn't like feel rushed to me. But I know that uh, a whole lot more could have been implemented uh, if, if if they had a longer stretch to work on. Oh, here's some of Dean's stash right here. Oh my god, Lich Demon, you don't like my take on the talking death claws? You like those boys? Oh my god. I didn't say they were bad uh, people. I guess they're not people, but you know, like, nefarious characters or anything like that. I just, uh, I, didn't, I didn't like the idea of it. When I was a kid, I thought it was neat, but like, as I grew older, I was like, god damn, that's dumb. <laughs> like, I just, you know what I mean? Like, I just didn't like it. Oh, I did find a, some bobby pins. Fuck yeah. Um... So I agree with Chris Avalon. Dude, and Arissa, you became a member. Oh my god. I'll be good you guys are amazing. I Thank you so much, Arissa. Just keep him away. Yeah, we're almost to 100. Hot diggity daffodils. That's amazing. Okay, so I was just down here looking around. Okay. Requires key. Right. So hungry. Oh shit, look at that. I'm not gonna waste that ability. Alright, and then uh I bet you the helmet yep. Fucking knew it. Yes. And we still get the rebreather, hello. Got the police pistol. Yes. Dog, back in the cage. What have we here? You weren't who I was expecting. I'm disappointed. Still, even if you aren't my intended guest, you take direction. Good. 
You can't have been an idiot to figure out how to release me from my cage. Or perhaps you are, with that leash on your arm, and the one around your neck. With our collars and manacles, why, we may as well be kin. I'm the voice of reason. I sleep sometimes. Down in the basement, in the cage. Now that I'm awake, Dog goes back in the cage. Dog knows I'm here, but can't do anything about it. I'm his... conscience. Keep him tame, keep him from hurting us. Doing foolish things. I've been trapped in here for some time. I'm gonna answer your question then you come after this let me Kabuskus. So, you opened my cage for a reason. Now, I want to know why. Uh, Kabuskus asked why I deleted the I'm Tired video. Uh, at first it was private, and then I do think I actually, like, fully deleted it. Um... I used that video as a way to vent out some frustrations that I had personally that coincided with my YouTube work. Uh, I do that, I, I've done that sometimes before to get advice from my audience and to talk. Most people, uh, it, was a, it was a fairly liked video. It had like a 98% like rating. So it wasn't because it was like uh, not liked or I got hate for it or anything. I literally just thought it wasn't. Uh, it's not. It wasn't something that needed to remain public on my channel when the rest of my content is like, oh, look at this Fallout stuff, or a Fallout iceberg, or a Fallout stream, or video game facts, and then it's like, oh my god, here's me having a mental breakdown over something you probably don't even fucking understand because I'm not giving you the full information, and like, so it was just, it, it just felt like an odd video to be, um, to remain up, you know what I mean? Uh, that, that, that That's literally all it was, is I was just like, ah, this isn't... The type of, you know, it's not the type of content I wanted out. I would, yeah, I was burnt out and uh, I have some, I had some beef with Bethesda, like, That's personally. The easy explanation. The one And it came out in that video. <laughs> Pre-war technology, as if it's the cause of all ills, mind and body. I needed to come out of the cage to protect Dog from clever humans like you. Do you see these wounds of his covering his skin? The bear trap on his arm. He placed his own Yeah, Matthew, good advice. It, the name he carved in his chest. To remind him of who he is, he inflicts pain on himself to silence me when all I try to do... Uh, hey, Summer. Uh, happy New Year to you, too. To murder me out of happy him. New Year to everybody he in the chat. Succeed just makes me angrier dog is the beast we simply change cages like the ones here hey matthew thank you very much for the kind words man it's close closer than i'd like dog's been into things needs to think before he eats chew before he swallows he's Eager that way. Now the collars are part of me. Inside. I can feel Well, Azrael, more stoned heartbeat. lore is coming. Clicking and burning I, uh. Below. Like before. I worked on that Fallout Iceberg, and I'm working on another one. I'm, I'm gonna be doing cage. another one that's longer. Now you're here. And I'm and doing another long again, Fallout New Vegas facts video. So in between leash. working on those, I'll be, uh. I was, I was going to do Thrasher, Skate, and Destroy. Or, well, rather, I was going to do Half-Life, but Half-Life is going to take a lot longer than I thought it was going to. Uh, I've played through maybe a quarter of the game, which is my like the farthest I've played through Half-Life, so it's been very interesting. But uh, I'm going to do a couple of smaller games in between uh, that longer project, so for people who have been following that, there is more of that to come. And, uh, thank you for checking it out. Uh, the next one, I, I don't know, it should be soon. But uh, like I said, I'm working on some other stuff with uh, with this channel as well. So there's that. Really? Yet it led you here to me, and now you're here, and it's burning a hole in my guts. Maybe it's crying for its owner.
They detach. When segmented, they look like nothing more than metallic rad scorpions. And if they're attached to neck flesh, warm, red, Dog doesn't care what's on the body he's crushing in his hands. He'll mangle it, twist it, make it fit until he's full. Dog can't help himself. Hungry. Greedy. And now the collar's inside. Alive again. And we're trapped here until it goes cold. As if I had a choice. Sometimes instinct takes over. And that's when I go into the cage. It's like curiosity that way. After all, you wouldn't have put that collar on by choice. Perhaps it was your curiosity that caused that hand to close on your neck. Of course you do. And so do I. The key? Why, it's the old man. The one who brought us here. I hid the key on me so Dog wouldn't know. Uh, thank you I for another fat 650 there, so Daniel. Hey, My dogs are barking, talk. sorry about that. I've, uh, I feel like Fallout 3, Bethesda tried, but Fallout 4 story, you felt like they were giving up. Well, you can't be mad at Bethesda. That's fair. I also feel like the Fallout 4 story is a bit, always. like, shallow. And I can't have that. Main quest especially. Dog obeys. Yes. Why? Do you have some means of contacting the old man? You... Don't play it. If you do, I'll find a way to get out of the cage. End you. I'll murder you. Crush your arms and legs until... No, you wouldn't. If you did, you won't escape this place alive. I'd shatter every one of your limbs to splinters and leave you here. You think I'm afraid of your collar exploding, killing us? No. I'll leave you breathing, then keep walking until my collar goes cold. I'll prop your broken body in view of the Sierra Madre so you can see what you came to steal. Forever out Yeah, no of kidding, Lost Wolf. And, uh, hey there, Adam. Uh, welcome to the stream. Good to see you. Prove it. How? Words are worthless. Oh man, Majora's Mask. Like, so, um, when it came out, I played it, but I never really got into Ocarina of Time or Majora's Mask. Uh, my, my friends growing up, a couple of them were very into them, and I'd always, like, you know, watch them playing them and stuff, but I just could never really get into the Zelda games. Fucking great games, though. Like, I understand that, but it's just like, I, I could never personally get into them. No. No, you're not. Even though Dog's more docile, easier to control. You may regret this. This place. This place is where creatures like Dog can survive. The people that fill its streets. He is as vicious, more vicious than them. His hunger can help you more than I can. When I am in control, this shell is difficult to fight in. <laughs> I am not sure you belong here. No. I guess we're we're gonna try to keep here. God instead yes. of uh, you came this letting far, dog out. Even though letting dog out would in help us a lot longer. in combat. I'll unlock the cage. Very well. Lead on. Oh, and we can uh, lightly step around traps. Hey, Sublime Mime with a fat $5 super chat. Fallout 4 is one of my favorite games, but my least favorite fall. Hey, I understand that. Yeah, uh, I think it's a super fun game as well. Uh, but yeah, that I felt like the main quest, just the main quest, there's there's plenty of awesome things to find in Fallout 4, and I, I do enjoy my time with it. But I feel like the main quest, especially after Fallout 3, just felt a little shallow. I really should be using that... Uh, Oh, he had the bear trap fist, too. The fucking... Nice spear. So 
Got him. Okay. Am I not ro watching Rose Bowl? Because I'm playing some New Vegas, man. So we're picking up some of these Sierra Madre chips. Because once we get the stim pack situation, they come in very handy. Did I get to keep my stim packs? Or did he take them from me? Fuck, he took them from me. I had like 50 of them. Here, taste like copper. Or old world gold. Come on down, big boy. These things are amazing. Oh, Stimmy. Is that Rataway over here? What is this? Whiskey? Okay. Easy Fallout. You've never played New Vegas? I recommend that you do. If you are not, uh, if you are telling the truth and you have not played New Vegas, I uh, highly recommend it. I probably recommend New Vegas the most out of any game that I've ever recommended to anybody. Because you can play it at your own speed, you can do whatever you want. It has a great story, great companions, great side quests, great environment. If it isn't the clever one. Actually, you're right, uh, God. I don't know why I'm talking to you. We're going this way. Hell yeah. Uh, Steam Winter Sale, if you game on PC, uh, I know that these are on sale to a very high extent, and they're already not... I think, like, the Ultimate Edition of New Vegas that has, like, all of the like DLCs copper. and stuff, I think that normally is, like, $20.00. So, it being on sale, I bet you it's like five or under right now. Six bucks, something like that. Uh, and that's far worth it. That's far worth the price. Okay. Calm down there, partner. Well, out there's none of my business. Yeah, Anthropologue, I'm right up there with you, man. Um, okay, so... Have that. So, let's see. Let's see if we can get this. Oh my god. If we're gonna hit it. Oh, well, maybe. We're only three caps away. That'll work. Anyway, we got it. 
Okay, so let's... Yeah, bark, 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 yeah, that's what they do. How bad will Fallout 5 be? Um, I don't, dude. I really don't even think we're gonna see a Fallout 5, honestly. Like, if we do, it's gonna be like 15 years from now. Maybe I'll tear it off your arm, wear it on my neck. Trying to lose me in the cloud? No. Super fat ten dollar super chat from Sublime Mime again. Uh, happen to be near the end of Dead Money currently. I remember playing it for the first time and being told ghost people are hard to kill, then using a lead pipe and annihilating them with ease. Yeah, you just gotta destroy one of their limbs, and then you're good to go. Yeah, see, what we need to get is the stim packs from this. Obviously, they're not showing up, but uh, when we do have them, it's pretty, it's pretty goddamn good. Yes, but thank you, Sublime Mind, for the fat $10 super chat. And thank you to everybody who's hanging out in the chat and uh, watching the stream. I appreciate you guys. Watch out for traps big time. I already see one right now, right in front of us as we speak. It's over here. Okay, water. Okay. Okay. Just watch and see. I'm watching for traps. Like this. Okay. Yeah, Nerissa, I'm glad that you're here too. Uh, seeing a lot of familiar f uh, faces that I haven't seen in a while. Yeah, Patty Dunn did it, made those emojis for the memberships, and uh, they're fantastic. I'm just making sure here. I like to try to make sure. I'm looking around through the Sierra Madre. Because finding stuff is your best friend. <laughs> Okay. 
wasn't really paying attention about where I should be going right now. Looks like this way. No dice. Okay, let's go. Get out of this fucking cloud. Not a chance. Kill this one before they call others. Wrecked. Okay, um... Okay, so we got Dean next, and like, I forget who said it in the chat. Was it Jedi who said it in the chat? But, uh, you gotta make sure to not try to do the speech checks with him, or he becomes a bastard later on. I do enjoy ending him, but we'll try keeping him alive. He does suck, though. In the sense that he's a dick. Alright, let's, uh... At least this one seems like a straight shooter. Or sucker. Couldn't leave well enough alone. Have a seat, and then we'll talk. The Sierra Madre. Beauty, isn't she? She the one who invited you here? Or maybe you didn't catch her voice on the radio. Woke up confused like some of the others. At least you're still breathing. By the way, don't get up or make any sudden motions, no matter how uncomfortable that chair gets. The cushion's just for show. Might be a bit rude, but that chair you're sitting in, it's got a shaped charge in the seat cushion. Get up without my permission. I'll blast your ass so far through your head, it'll turn the moon cherry pie red. So, let's keep this sweet and polite, and finish our conversation with no misunderstanding. Just because I work in entertainment doesn't mean I'm a moron. I heard my necktie beeping. I know what that means. I'm part of Oh, Dingus, it's the barter checks I later on? Out of this contract. Oh, well, shit. Well, I'm still playing it safe. Out, I'm not going to be too happy. So whatever's going on here, if you're part of all this, you're taking orders from me. Good, good, then we're in business. I may be a betting man, but I like it when the odds are in our favor. If you're here with who I think, then I'd rather have you on my side than his. And it's in the hole. You want to live, I want what's in the madre. Real simple. Wait, wait. Wait just a minute. I'm not walking out there on my own. I know what's out there. It's why I've planted a minefield, shotguns, and explosives all the way on the road to my little boudoir here. So we go together or we're not going at all. I'll split my hand in blackjack when the time's right. I'm not splitting up in this town. Trust me. All right, all right, but you already got company, so tell you what, I'll meet you it's at like, the fountain. Hey, meet me at the fountain. No, um, take the long way back. you're fucking sure. dealing with me, and then it's like, but you already have somebody with you, so I'll meet you at the fountain. Damn it, I was going to, uh, taking Dean with us isn't so bad. Where'd he fucking go? I'll end here. Oh my god. And when I went down to Mexico, we stayed in a, a villa that was similar in design to this. Like, uh, there was a lot of them. Uh, and it made me think of it the whole time, like, oh shit. I mean, there wasn't a big casino, like, over, like, looming over it, like... This has but kill this one before they call up. Uh -huh. 
We got it. Okay. Touched by radiation, and you choose to spend your time here. You could have just left, but you're too obsessed to let go. They yeah, used to Dean. Have a ventriloquist with more skill than you. At least he had the sense to know his own name without carving it into his chest. Ooh. Tell me my name when needed. Burn. But I have a name for you. Several. Thief. Coward. Ooh. Showman. Radiation couldn't kill the truth, could it? The truth, buddy, is this. You and me were now family as long as we got these bow ties on. So watch your mouth, you don't scare me. Damn, son. If it isn't the cult, you. Okay. It's taking that human. So. Still has stim packs. It's like, whatever. nope. Okay, weapons. I want. I want. Three. Four. Also want to That's some bullshit, okay. Whatever. I was gonna fast travel there and then sleep. But we'll just find a suitable place to sleep later. Mr. Husk, yeah, I love New Vegas uh, multiplayer. I'm a member of their Patreon. Uh, it was one of my favorite par uh, projects to support. Uh, loved it every time I've gotten on there. It's good to hear that it's gotten even better. Fuck. Whoops. Yeah, I ditched companions so that uh, we can uh, deal. We can just grab Christine when we're there. Oh shit. on the other side of this shit. to gear up our fucking unarmed. How many hours do I have in New Vegas? On Steam, it's... I think it's close to, like, 800 on Steam. But it, uh... I played majority on Xbox 360 back when it came out. So a lot... There it is. Uh, I want that code. Uh, for Stimpex. Uh, so a lot of my time's on there. So I, it, it's over a thousand for sure. Okay. So. Um... 
I hear Christine banging around. Yeah, let's get some Christine emojis in the chat. Lost Wolf, you have the right idea. I enjoy that. Oh, fuck. Uh -huh. Okay, it's not anything ED and it's not orbital. Orbital had one in common. Oh shit. Got him. Oh, of course. Should about Dean Domino. Being a fucking menace again. I don't know if my science is high enough to disable these things, which I really wish it was. Oh, hell yeah. My repair is. Yeah, at New Vegas Day this uh, this last year, I have the costume contest uploaded. Uh, somebody dressed up as Christine, and it was just fucking ridiculously good. She didn't talk the whole time. She used sign language, like rudimentary sign language. It was fucking awesome. Man. Knocked it out of the park. Take that clipboard. Yeah, but we're just kind of looting around the place real quick as we head towards Christine. Yeah, I agree. Uh, definitely. Rest in peace, Mitten Squad. Uh, that's one of the things that hit me the hardest last year. It wasn't even that long ago, honestly, but... miss that armor that's down here either. I think it's in here. The assassin suit. It's good shit. Uh, sneak plus 10. And it looks dope. Ah shit. My chat's all fucked up now. Fixed. All right, there we go. So, OK. 
Yeah, we got a protected speaker down there. We'll just head down here. There we go. Can I have to agree with you there, Dingus? That's a top tier armor combination. The assassin suit plus ranger vet helmet. What's my favorite exploit in New Vegas? I get asked this every once in a while, but I don't really do exploits or glitches that uh, often. The one that I actually use and use often, like the only one that I really use, is uh, taking skilled and then remaking your character. You know, like, uh, like when you leave, it's like, are you sure this is how you want your character to be? And you can, like, reset your special. If you take skilled again, it doubles it, and you can do that again in Old World Blues. Those are the only, that's just the only time I really use them. I love this, like, silent NPC uh, situation that they did here with her and, like, just describing what she's doing. It's like, they know that the creation engine, like, the, you know, Obsidian knew that this engine right, right, could have been technically still called the Gamebryo engine when this was made. <coughs> but they knew the limitations of it, so being able to describe, you know, what she's doing and how she's communicating, I've, I've always really liked that a lot. We did it, boys. And she gives us, in my opinion, like the best perk, which is uh, a little bit more time when your caller's beeping. Oh, fuck yeah. Fallout Alaska would be pretty interesting. I think Fallout Hawaii would be really good, too.
Alright, we get it. So. I want unarmed weapons. Wait, how's my sneak? Get sneak up to... A good amount. Okay. Dead. I don't know where Christine ran off to. Get this desk open. Goes moving around. Yeeted and deleted. Man, I would love it if Fallout 5 was as good as New Vegas. Wouldn't that be incredible? That was in response to. Um, CA's comment in the chat. Someone also asked uh, Jedi talking about uh, New York. Was it ever established that the Enclave rem remnants moved there? Uh, I think that's just a fan theory. I could be wrong. Maybe I missed some lore. From what I understand about New York, what I've always understood about New York was that it was completely destroyed. I'm not exactly sure where I picked up that information, but it's just always been in the back of my mind that New York is just completely wrecked. All right, we've made it back. Good. Well done. Now for the festivities and your part in all this. The owner of the Sea of the Mind, for whatever reason, keyed the grand opening to the gala event itself. It needs to be fired off in order for the casino doors to open. As I discovered, one person can't do it. So get your team into position indicated on your clipboard and trigger it properly. You're so close now. Don't let me down. Otherwise, yeah, that's what I always thought in Rissa, was that there was just, like, New York was directly... I mean, like, a lot of cities got directly hit, and, like, you know, like, Boston got directly hit, but we still, you know, but, like, apparently directly hit, like, to oblivion. <laughs> like, just, like, directly hit multiple times at the same time. I'll keep monitoring you via the transceivers through the villa. If I need to offer guidance, I will. A display of lights, fireworks, music in the streets, a pre-war festival to mark the casino's opening. Hell yeah. The struck first. It is of no consequence, only firing the event. Christopher, good to see you. Get the three in position. Fall at New York could just be unarmed combat. <laughs> After that, nice to see you. Uh, Atlas the Vagabond, good to see you. Northern Tommy, it's not explicit, but heavy implied. Uh, to the north, nothing but rubble from us. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, Tommy, I was under the same impression. And uh, Dan Vaman, good to see you. Hey Damien, hello to Poland from the USA. It's good to see you. Atlas. I'm I'm waving right back at you, buddy. I'd suggest taking the FEV reject to his position first. Alright, let's do that then, is Elijah. He? Where's he at? So I would Make 
sure we have the right quest enabled. How's the wrestling training? Um, I haven't been back to school in a while. Um, I'm going to start doing ring announcing for the f the, the the group. Uh, Relentless Wrestling is what it's called. Um, I want to get into better shape before I actually hit the ring anymore. Uh, I don't want to get hurt and have to go, you know, get a surgery or something like that over just, like, something I want to do as a hobby. So I've been, like, I've been moving towards exercise and eating better and then you know, maybe doing that. Uh, I got... Something. Uh, we, we decided uh, to book Mustafa Ali for one of uh, the shows coming up in a, in a couple months in March. And I helped them out with that. I paid for like half of Mustafa's, Mustafa, uh, half of his booking fee I took care of. And since he's fresh out of the WWE, it's, you know, like it can get kind of pricey for some of those guys to come down. But uh, I really wanted more eyes on Relentless Wrestling over here. And I figured somebody like that fresh out of the WWE is a good way to do that. Um, understandably, you know, these are people, that, the people that run Relentless, they're just normal people with normal jobs, you know. And uh, there's something on my screen. I'm trying to get it off one second. Um, so they can't pay, you know, thousands of dollars to just one dude to run, the, you know, these shows are already 10, 15 grand to put on, let alone an extra, you know, like, you know, a few thousand dollars for just one guy to show up. So I, uh, I, I pitched to uh, the booker that any time there was a chance to book somebody that did have that kind of a price tag that I would take half of it on to uh, help them out and try to get fucking uh, try to get more eyes on the, on, on, on the group, you know. Yeah, Mustafa is, is looking fucking uh, jacked to the, the jacked to the brim, man. Uh, I I don't know anything about you know like what he's fucking doing his workout or whatever. Uh, someone in the chat said, "Roids, you know, I, I don't make those accusations because everybody's body works differently, and you know they start working out and they start doing other things. Like, you know, fucking, who knows? Like, what they got going on. So I, I would never, you know, make that. Like, oh, this guy's on this or this guy's on that. Uh, he could have just started working out way more and like eating way different, you know, and just got fucking yoked. But regardless." We booked him for a uh, show in March. Super stoked on that. He's one of the best wrestlers in the world, in my opinion. I'll end you. And that's all I have to say about that. that felt good. You'll pay me to suplex you? Alright, man. <laughs> oh, look at this. Okay, let's get the Nightkin to his fucking location. I can't find the way back down. There it is. Shit. Now we can do stim packs. 20 of them, please. Thank you. Correct. Thomas, you never played any of the New Vegas DLC. Oh my goodness. You should definitely check them out. They're fucking wild. 
<laughs> They're really good. All of them are super good. Kill this one. Ooh. Oh my god, even more. Don't be a dick about it. Let's. <laughs> oh, we did it. Get fucked. This is the shortest way back through the fog. What's my favorite DLC currently? It is Old World Blues. But they are all really good. <coughs> Whoops, you doodles. That was terrible what just happened there. Okay. What in the f- Alright. It's like the sideshow bob bit with fucking the rakes in The Simpsons. <laughs> no, I'm not playing on hardcore. This is just normal difficulty. Floating above the fountain, the boss man, the one who put these bow ties on our necks. So no, look. Shut up, Dean. <laughs> Take Dean to his spot. Going to need a hand here, partner. <laughs> Those machines, Sinclair's little gifts, lasted longer than he did. Hardcore dead money Before is fine. I can see how some people would enjoy the hardcore dead money run. <laughs> It's definitely what it sounds like, though. It is hardcore and it is dead money. When uh, when I got the went through to get the achievement for the hardcore run, I literally just played through the main quest like straight through. What the fuck, we can't go through there. Oh, oh. Good. Shit, shit. Okay, we did it. 
It will curl. Hell yeah, man. Uh, I'm glad that I was able to share that Good Springs video. And I hope you do make it out there. And you guys have a good time. It's a fucking great little spot. Okay. It's getting out of hand now. I feel like I'm maybe supposed to go the other direction on top of the rooftops. Watch out if you see a prize lying around. Dude, I always get lost and confused in this. Sierra Madre. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Fuck you. Obsidian, nice. Fucking real cool guys. Just trying to live. Oh, the tree is lovely this time of year. Oh, Blooming and green. Going to need a hand here. Ooh, boy. I need to just use a doctor's bag so that my limbs are just. Yeah, maybe look at the floor once in a while? Yeah, maybe. You'd think I'd learn by now. Anthropology guy. I mean, you're fucking not wrong. Oh, well, fuck. We did it. I am all about keeping low in this section of town. So the reason I'm using that so much with the the bear trap fist is because when I try when I try hitting them without vats, I'm either missing or not doing as much damage. Because we're getting him in like two punches in vats, and I just swing wild, Sonny, when I'm not in vats. So turn on the flashlight so you can see traps better. Hey, you know what? You're you're really onto something there. It's not a bad idea. I clicked it on. He's down there taking care of business right now. And I don't feel like going down there and helping him. Alright, Dean. I have not gotten around. I mean, I've played Borderlands before. So, 
this is where I'm supposed like to I played it with my show. friends back when it came out I've uh, I think I streamed the third one when it came out um, and back when the first one came out like I said I played it with my friends you know a couple hours here and there nothing um, concrete I mean, nothing so concrete, uh, nothing like uh, consistent enough to really say that I've played them. But no, I'm going to start with the first one and just like go through them all. Probably add them to Stone Delore. And guh, for this uh, playthrough, we've already done Honest Hearts, and then this is the second uh, DLC that we have gone after. Well, safely? Around here, that word doesn't look. Uh, the ghost people... Okay, we're skipping through that. No. Fuck. Oh, you know. Do I have a fucking science book or some mintats? The mintats wouldn't help, honestly. I do not have a science book. Alright, fuck it. I tried, I tried, but I failed. <laughs> I think we need to get up in there. Um. Bada boom, we should be leveling up soon. That's 100 just for when I try to sneak out with the bars. Hey, Nikki, thank you very much for becoming a vault dweller. Welcome to a tribe called Mantis. Um, yeah, you guys have, uh, I thank you so much for uh, joining the channel memberships. Like I said, there's going to be this year, especially, you know, new year, new stuff. <laughs> um, there'll be, a, I'm going to do members videos. A lot of the main videos that I put out will be up early for members because YouTube's facilitating that a lot better now. So, becoming a member will have more value than just in the streams. Also, make sure to join the Discord if you're a member because there's a lot of, uh, like, the benefits apply to that. I'm honestly thinking, ooh, dude, silent running. Fuck. Wait. Shit. I wanted, uh... Light step was what I thought that was in my head. Where is light step? I did not see it grayed out. Does that mean that it is available? Because then we won't have to worry about all that shit. Light touch. Where the fuck is light step? Maybe you need silent running to get light step? But then I feel like it'd be grayed out. So that I could see that. Oh, light step. Perception six, agility six, so I probably just don't have that. Alright, whatever. Fuck. Oh shit, my bad. Um Okay, well then God, I'm thinking of tagged. Silent running is alright, but I'm not going to be a sneak character. I just needed my sneak skill to be a little higher. And it is now. I, I, let's see. Lessons learned. I don't care about that. Um, tag. Purifier. I wonder if that applies to ghost people.
I just took another toughness rank. Dude, fucking, I'm taking tag. I don't even care. Maybe I'll tag science. Um, which might be a good idea. Barter's another good idea to do its weight perks. Yeah, I think tag's pretty solid too. I feel like some people have shit on it before. Um, but when you're streaming a playthrough, I feel like you know the way we're doing this playthrough, it's fine. Let's uh, see if we can buy these without giving them way too much fucking money. In the doctor's bag. There we go. See ya. How many do we have? 21? Ghost or abominations? Have okay. How about that? A great copy. And one of the waitresses? Wrong oh, shit. Haha. Boom. Didn't think much of it. Hopefully that didn't make it an, an enemy of mine. Okay, so... I feel like this is not... Oh, no. We did it. It loses meaning when you have a high intelligence character. Let me see, what is our intelligence? Our intelligence is pretty high. But whatever, it's fine. I probably shouldn't have taken it, actually. You're not wrong. But, be like I said, because of the nature of this playthrough, it it isn't as... I don't know. Because, like, we're, we're going to go through the DLCs and then do the, you know, finish up the main quest. It'll help us max. Fuck. Should have did science. All right, let's go. Okay. Yeah, Nikki, uh, already taking to the Christine emojis like a champ. That is uh, absolutely appropriate at a time like this. Let's see. Hey, we're doing all right. Dunzo. Fuck. Any mods? Just stabilization mods. Uh, if you were to go to Nexus and look up Gophers stabilizing mods, like uh, collection, that's the mods that I have installed. Uh, other than that, no, it's vanilla. So it has the unofficial, like, uh, the unofficial patch. 
but vanilla past that. Ah, fuck, we probably should have really done science based on what we're gonna have to do with Christine next. Yeah, Nikki, I'm the same way. Christine's like one of the best characters in the Fallout series. Unexpected Bagel, good to see ya. Alright. Yeah, repair does continue to be OP, dingus. It's a smart chat tonight. I'm just gonna have to cut and run through the fog. Watch out for traps. Really wish I could have taken light stuff. There's hella traps down here, if I remember correctly. Oh shit. Come on, get out of there. Ooh, it's a red one. Oh good. That noise certainly means that I won't be killed as soon as I'm done doing this. One correct, so it's not ER driver, so... It could be ED. It is. But it's ranged. Boom! Uh, I have played a little bit of Halo Reach. I, I, the Halo I played the most was Halo 3. Me and my friends, dude, like... Oh! Oh, I'm so lucky. I am so lucky. Okay. I knew that was going to happen. And actually, I didn't know that was going to happen. I thought I was going to be killed. But, uh, we, uh... <laughs> we got through it. But Reach is great. Wait, do I need to be on the other side? Shit. Yeah, Ashton, thanks. What happened? Um, I hit a trap that released grenades. So when we uh, came back... Oh, oh. Oh, oh! Good. I deserve that. I think that's only like the second death of the run, though. obvious references to WWF's Honky Tonk Man? No, but uh, I've hung out with that guy uh, last year. Back uh, in June. I uh, spent like a couple hours with him at uh, Spokane Comic Con. Just chatting with him and it was one of the best experiences I've ever had. I don't remember if we learned anything from this. Alright, now we don't have to worry about that, uh, cloud. Oh, 
Oh my god. Christ. All right. Oh, we're almost there. Good. With automatic rifle. Hell of a gun. Oh, shit. Above us? Oh, it's right there. Oh my god. Holy shit. Even the locks fuck with you in dead money. Alright. So it's definitely ED. Oh, it could be... Alright, it's ED. Alright. Oh my god. Uh, cosplay is a uh, uh, great con next year. I do love the cons. What can I say? Oh, well, that would have been handy. What's this one doing? Master Chief versus Frank Horrigan. I'm gonna say Frank Horrigan. We did it. Anything up here? Ah, oh, fuck yeah. Doom Marine versus Horgan? Doom Marine. What do you think this is? Doom guy wins every time. I'm not even that big of a Doom fan, I just know the fucking way it goes, you know? Alright, so we're gonna go trigger this gala event. Oh, did it again, boys. I feel like I'm being super extra. About getting to where I need to be.
Ah, shit. Okay. Okay. So I will... So what, you would think this way, right? Let's try this. Oh shit. Um, I always get fucking lost in this DLC. <laughs> I mean, I could just check a map. Ooh. Is it just never gonna stop? That's dope. Oh, we fucked around and found out, boys. I thought I could outrun it. I thought I could outrun it. through bear traps again. Gonna get blown up because I didn't take care of the speaker. Oh, we're not beeping right now. Hey, hey, hey. Must be on the other side, right? Oh, damn you. Huh. I was just going faster. Shit. This is a trap. I've done seen that before. I ain't falling for it. Not today, pilgrim. I'm curious about. Okay, good. Oh my god! These fucking bear traps. Okay. Oh my god! <laughs> Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. 
buddy. But, uh... Had one right there. Another one. Oh, good. Got him. Oh yeah, it's like the only place in the game you'll see the embalming fluid item. There it is, boys. Hey, Jade Lily, good to see you. Uh, Northern Tommy, oh, you're just responding to somebody else. Ashton still don't know why there are so many, but yeah, what's the deal with all the bear traps? I guess it's, it, was, it was it was probably trying to curb the ghost people before like all the actual humans like died. It was like the only thing they can think of to try to keep him at bay. Christ. Okay. No, there's gonna be more traps. They've been getting me with them. Nice. And the caller just started beeping. Oh, good. What the fuck happened there? Haha. Go, boys. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Well, I need to end the stream anyway because my wife is home and uh, <laughs> hang out with her. I don't know what the fuck that was about, but that's a perfect way to end the stream. Uh, when we start the next stream, I'll probably do tomorrow or the day after. Uh, we will start the gala and finish Dead Money. Thank you guys for coming out. Everybody who became a member and uh, super chatted and stuff like that, thank you big time. And uh, I hope to catch you guys on the next one. No, I, I, I gotta go, Mazo, sorry. But uh, thank you guys for coming out. I will see you next time. It has been Mantis. <laughs>